I am Dr. Mohammed Nakoda from Biotechnology. And um, I conducted the student evaluation with Fundani uh, in my first year class last year. Uh, I chose the first year class because this is the first year is where we have the highest amount of attrition. Um, these are students who just come out of the high school environment and often student expectations and academic expectations are not aligned. In order for us to remain responsive, uh, sensitive and dynamic. Um, it's imperative that we give the students an opportunity to evaluate the experiences in the classroom so that we can then um, design appropriate teaching practices to meet these challenges. Given the opportunity, students can be very clear in communicating their needs in the classroom. Um, based on my feedback, I was told that one of the major challenges was um, regard to the language um, the language of science. Students found this to be quite, um, a, a, quite a challenge. Um, so having this feedback, it allowed me to, you know, you can then ameliorate this and design and implement remedial measures to address any difficulties that students have in the classroom. It is eventually the prerogative of the academic to consolidate the feedback that they receive from this evaluation and uh, design appropriate measures uh, to enhance the learning experience in the classroom. I think getting students involved in such an exercise gives them the confidence to know that we share a common vision of teaching excellence and uh, success in higher education. It is therefore important to provide the cohort with the feedback um, based on what, they, what they've given and show them how we would implement this, these suggestions going forward. I did meet this cohort already, so um, I made reference to the feedback and I told them that um, I really appreciated the feedback that they provided last year and, um, and this is how I, will, I, was, I plan on um, implementing whatever uh, suggestions that they gave me. So particularly in respect of the, the language difficulty, I have uh, developed some remedial exercises to help them overcome that.